Well, this is our uh, first test with the Cajun Commander. It's running a 3S pack. We had to, had to change the air cooled, uh, the water cooled speed controller that it comes with, which failed straight out of the, uh, the box. And we fitted an air cooled one. Um, which is hence the reason why it's hanging by a little bag until we can, uh, hanging by a little strap rather on the boat until we can waterproof it. Just see a little green strap on there, but other than that, it uh, handles very well. Accelerates like a rocket. It should be a good rescue boat for our bigger boats. Yeah. It's low speed handling's good and it goes over the weeds here without any problem. And as you saw at the start of the video, we drive it down onto the grass. It didn't matter was it a beach here or we can just... Yeah. The... So funny when it was going down the middle of the shop. most fun on an icy lake that isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> Over ice that's gonna be so fast. Or snow and what well, an ice it'll have less drag than water. Yeah. Well this is our first uh, on water test with a Cajun commander with a 3S packing and it's going much much faster than uh, we thought it would do. It turns on a dime and it's <laughs> Sounds fantastic doesn't it? <laughs> So, oh, how about the lights? There's... Yeah, you turn it. Turn that switch on. There's a switch down there. Oh, this yeah. one. And then all the lights come on. Oh wow! And they run off a separate battery pack. Oh shit! Save draining the main one. Yeah. Oh, Overall, okay, there it well, is. for our first impressions of the Cajun Commander airboat, uh, pretty good there. Many thanks to uh, to Tim there for doing the driving while I filmed and. Hope you liked this video. If you did, then please do like and subscribe. Thanks for watching.